Can Bernese mountain dogs coexist with pet reptiles or amphibians indoors? Choosing a pet for your home is a big decision, especially if you already have other animals in your household. Bernese mountain dogs are known for their gentle and friendly nature, making them great companions for families. However, if you are considering getting a Bernese mountain dog and also have pet reptiles or amphibians, you may wonder if they can coexist peacefully under one roof. In this article, we will explore whether Bernese mountain dogs can live harmoniously with pet reptiles or amphibians indoors. Bernese mountain dogs are a large breed with a calm temperament and a love for their family members. They are known for their patient and gentle disposition, which makes them suitable for families with children. However, when it comes to reptiles and amphibians, their prey drive may take over, causing them to see these pets as potential prey. Bernese mountain dogs have a strong hunting instinct, so it's essential to take precautions before introducing them to your pet reptiles or amphibians. One crucial factor to consider is the size and type of reptile or amphibian you have as a pet. Smaller animals, such as frogs or geckos, may be more vulnerable to a Bernese mountain dog's curiosity and playfulness. Their instinct to chase moving objects might trigger them to pursue these smaller pets, potentially causing harm or stress. Therefore, it's best to avoid keeping small reptiles or amphibians in the same living space as a Bernese mountain dog. On the other hand, larger reptiles or amphibians may have a better chance of coexisting with a Bernese mountain dog. Animals like turtles or adult snakes are less likely to be perceived as prey and can potentially share a space with the dog safely. However, even with larger animals, it's crucial to closely monitor their interactions and make sure the reptiles or amphibians have adequate hiding spaces. Providing a secure and separate habitat for the reptiles or amphibians can help reduce the risk of any potential conflict. Another essential aspect to consider is the temperament and training of your Bernese mountain dog. Proper socialization from a young age and obedience training can help reduce their prey drive and teach them to coexist peacefully with other pets. It's important to remember that each dog is unique and their tolerance towards reptiles or amphibians may vary. Some Bernese mountain dogs may be more accepting and gentle, while others may have a stronger prey drive. Take the time to assess your dog's behavior and consult with a professional dog trainer or behaviorist if needed. Introducing a Bernese mountain dog and a reptile or amphibian requires careful supervision and gradual introductions. Start by introducing the pets through a barrier, like a glass or mesh enclosure, allowing them to see and smell each other without direct contact. Observe your dog's reactions closely, looking for signs of aggression or excessive interest. If your dog shows excessive prey drive or aggression, it's best to keep them separated permanently to ensure the safety and well-being of both pets. Providing separate and secure spaces for each pet is crucial for their welfare. Reptiles and amphibians require specific environmental conditions, such as temperature and humidity, to thrive. The presence of a large dog can cause stress to these pets, so it's important to create a quiet and undisturbed area for them. This can be achieved by setting up their enclosures in a room or area where the dog doesn't have constant access or visibility. In conclusion, while Bernese mountain dogs are generally friendly and gentle, caution should be taken when considering coexistence with reptiles or amphibians. The prey drive and instinct of these dogs can pose a risk to smaller pets, making it best to avoid keeping them in the same living space. However, with proper supervision and a controlled environment, larger reptiles or amphibians may be able to coexist with a Bernese mountain dog. Remember to prioritize the safety and well-being of all pets involved and consult with professionals if needed.